hi friends welcome back to the channel i hope each and every one of you guys is doing well today you know i just couldn't stop thinking about the scripture i've given this message before in the past but i couldn't shake the scripture today and um it's coming from proverbs 9 verses 7 to 9 it says whoever corrects a mocker invites insult all right whoever rebukes a wicked man incurs abuse do not rebuke a mocker or he will hate you. Instruct a wise man and he will be wiser still. Teach a righteous man and he will add to his learning. All right. Listen, I believe that this is a good self-assessment to do on yourself to see are you are you wise or are you foolish? You know, and as the Bible is saying, you know, when you correct someone who is foolish you're gonna hate you and some of you guys probably have been there have you ever like corrected something somebody have you ever said um you know or even hold or held someone accountable for a behavior or call somebody out on a behavior and what happens they hated your guts right <laughs> they hated you right that's a foolish person okay ideally the bible is saying that person is a fool because a wise person, when you can call a wise person out, when you can check them, when you can hold them accountable for their actions or inactions, it says that they will be wiser and they will add to their learning, meaning that they will grow and they will appreciate you, okay? A lot of people don't have friends, they don't have family members that holds them accountable. They're just left to their own devices. And even in the scripture, it says God disciplines those he loves. Okay? God is God 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 don't spare the rod when it comes on to his kids. God do not spare the rod when it comes on to his children. He disciplines us because he loves us. Okay? So if you find somebody in your life who disciplines you, it's because they love you. They're not trying to uh, undermine you. They're not trying to make you look bad or feel some kind of way. It's because they love and they care for you. That's why they're holding you accountable. And that's why they're checking you in areas that needs to be checked. It's called love. That's what real love is, guys. All right, friends. Thank you so much for watching. Take care.